Hi there, this is Pranav from DBS Diary. Good morning, afternoon, evening, depending on your geographic location. I hope you are doing great. So this session I have recorded. Uh, in the previous one, we had to cover deadlocks, right, for SQL and Sybase. So just wanted to cover this that I have printed a PDF uh, for solution for all of them. Like there were three, four scenarios for MS SQL, which I showed how the deadlock is coming. And I did not show complete detail like how to solve them, right? So this video is for that. So it's a very uh, elaborative document which I have prepared. Okay, so maybe you can download and this is available on my website. And I have also given the link in the YouTube in the previous one, even in this video, I will give the link of that. So you can just find that out. So basically, if you if you can zoom in, so this is the initial page, and as you can see, there are six scenarios which I have covered, right? So you can see like preparation, how to how to prepare for it. So prepare means just create a database. How will you create a database in the SQL and Sybase both? One GB. I think I have already showed this in my video, but I just want to cover it complete detailed, right? So Sybase and MS SQL. This is for the preparation step, database creation and then uh, you know, allocating size to that. Then scenarios one, scenario one, scenario two, scenario three, four, five and six, and then table creation and data population, right? So you have to create table in Sybase and SQL, which I have done uh, in the video. It is both like same name table and same data is there. So let log scenario one. So this is the first page for preparation. Then you have next page which is data population and table creation. So this is the next page, right? So here you can see it like create table, then test and test underscore DL, then insert into table values and all. And then I put identity uh, you know, type of column uh, and, and primary key cluster, which I've already explained in the video. So all that is there. Then I have covered the scenarios, right? So scenario one, what we have covered in the video, then why did we have deadlock, rational of deadlock, which I, I think I have uh, talked about. And then it works well in MS SQL, but doesn't work in Sybase. So what is the reason that also I have covered. Then scenario two, again, it works for MS SQL, but doesn't work for Sybase. So even that I have covered, like why it is working in uh, uh, MS SQL and not working in Sybase. And then in the video, if you, if you recall, I have already explained like how to change the locking scheme of table and what all things we need to do for database option sp underscore db option right so uh, it is it is the solution for the sybase and then for ms sql i have given the solution because it did not work in the video if, if you recall so here if you scroll down further in the document so if you can print it out it will be more convenient so here i have given like how it works what is the issue how can we find out the problem first so by looking at the execution plan then second one gets uh, like blocked first and then deadlocked so here i have given the ex estimated execution plan so from here you can clearly make out the problem and then how to solve it also I have given okay so you have all the details so once the solution is there then you can uh, find it out that it works well and the plan will be different right so this is scenario three Similarly, I have scenario four. So for this also, I have given the solution, how to solve. First, I have showed how the problem is there, right? This is the first uh, query and the actual execution plan. Then the estimate execution plan where it gets stuck because I did not execute it uh, with the actual plan because it will not work, it will get blocked and deadlocked. So solution also I have provided. And then once the solution is there in place, then how it works, right? So this is scenario four. Then we have scenario five, right, for SQL Server. So again, the same thing I have done, which means I have executed it with the actual plan, the first query. Second one, I have done estimated execution plan, and then where it gets, I mean, you can make out from the execution plan itself. Then I've given the solution, and also I have given the rationale behind the deadlock. And then once the solution is in place, how it works well, right? 
So this is about the scenario 5. Similarly, I have given for scenario 6 also. So basically in this PDF or in this document, I have given solution for each of the deadlock and also have explained the rationale of deadlock like why deadlock is coming and how to avoid it. So this 6 scenario is just, uh, uh, it will help you in uh, how, how you can say it, like how to approach the problem, right? Deadlock is something which you will not have same kind of deadlock in your environment or if you, jo if you join somewhere else, right? But what you have to see is how to tackle it, where to start with, right? So in Sybase, we have seen uh, from the locking perspective from the like table uh, scheme, locking scheme of the table, right? MS SQL, it's a bit different, okay? Here you can have multiple solution and then based on that, you can see whether it's right versus right, it's right versus read. Right versus right also, again, you have to see number of rows affected. Then you have to see what is the next operation, how the execution plan looks like. So I have tried to cover everything in this document. So it's at nominal price and this will help me in maintaining my website. It will help in some, uh, you know, like uh, similarly, I can create more document which can help you. And uh, this is all, right? So let me know your feedback and I would really appreciate uh, to download that uh, if you can download and uh, you can buy from my website through the YouTube link, right? So that should be all. Let me know uh, if you have any feedback, if you have any comment, once you download, if you find some difficulty or if you think something I have missed out. So even that I can uh, incorporate. So it's at a like nominal price. So I would really request your help in that. Okay. And it will help you as well to learn how the deadlock is uh, in the cyber is how to find out deadlock, how to read deadlock, how to enable the uh, uh, printing deadlock information and then how to solve it, right? So multiple things I have explained and most of them are already there in the video, but for SQL server side, these deadlocks which is there, which I have not covered in the video, only one I think I have explained. So other deadlocks are already uh, no, having solution in this, in this document. So that should be all. So thank you for tuning. Uh, and if you like my content, do like, uh, you can pass your comment uh, in the form of comment and do subscribe. Okay, so thank you very much. Thank you. I appreciate your time. Thank you. Bye.